hi good morning um i just wanted to show you because the grasses are all coming uh into seed which means that they will be um setting seed some of them actually um set seed in a different kind of a way they grow obviously all their seeds and stuff but they also need to send out their pollen um so that they can be um they can fertilize other grasses it's very very clever because they don't have flowers uh, flying pollinators generally don't visit them because there's nothing to entice them in so most of the grasses um, actually let off their pollen in the breeze or if they're knocked and it flies and then it goes over the other grasses around and it gets pollinated if you like um, and it's very very clever um, and I've just witnessed and filmed actually very luckily and I'm going to pop it on the end of this little segment my dog going past a whole group group of um a whole row of um of grasses and because he's gone through the middle of them as my very um accident prone dog will um it's it's actually sent off some of its its pollen um, and that pollen is what it really aggravates people that have hay fever so grass pollen is one of the highest pollens that cause people to have hay fever so at this time of year um, uh, late spring early summer this is where most of the grass pollens are actually being released into the air um, but i will pop on the end of the segment the grass pollen being actually um, sent off on their way hope you enjoy it speak to you later bye Wow, what did you think of that? That was amazing, wasn't it? It's not often that you actually get to see a whole cloud of grass pollen actually being produced because what's happened is I'm actually walking my dog quite early in the morning and that pollen has got ready to go, um, possibly from late last night over this morning and it just needs the slightest little touch and it will go. So the amount of animals that will go past that this morning and the amount of people that are walking in that grass pollen will be going probably only first thing in the morning and then it will run out. So actually to get a grass pollen flume that you've just seen is actually quite unusual. Well, it's not unusual if you get up and go out in the mornings and if you um, head for the right kind of grass. So there you go, grass pollen. Hope you enjoyed it. I will see you later. Bye bye.